Aloha, Luana Moanas Ohana. Denise O'Connor here. And I am your host at Luana Moana's signature oceanfront Maui. Well, it's the end of August. Yeah, we survived August. And it was a historic month. <laughs> um, yeah, it was a historic month. I'm trying to keep it as positive as I can. Um, Lahaina has suffered a lot, although she is full of heart and soul because of her people. And I just have, and you know, it reminds me of one of my best friends. She, her name is Tina, and, and she um, has always described me as someone that when I am down, that for some reason from the rubble and the ashes, I rise up like a phoenix. Um, and I think with like just true grit that we have been seeing the last couple of weeks from the people, you know, there's just like this grass movement of the locals that because of their love for Ohana and their love for their lands, that um, they are rising up in the ashes too. Um, yes, so stay tuned. I will post down in the description some links of these amazing stories. You're gonna hear like how some buildings like survive, churches, um, what is happening with certain families and how they're regrouping, how they're trying to, they're getting their power back. Um, FEMA's on the ground. We'd like to see more of them in the community of Lahaina. But um, what is being done there? Um, what, uh, how people are being fed, like um, all the healing and the recovery efforts that are being done. I'll try to link as much of that down below. Um, missing people, there's like a list of missing people who's been found, who is not, um, stuff like that. So I'll list that down below because we want them to keep progress, keep moving forward and to heal and to grieve and, and for a better tomorrow of Lahaina and keeping Lahaina to the Maui people. Okay, so on that note, um, let's move on to uh, Luana Moana because of, of course her efforts are to support the Maui people um, and in doing so I have lowered the prices at Luana Moana. So please come to www.luanamoana.com. That's L-U-A-N-A-M-O-A-N-A.com. Um, and you can reach out to me. All my contact information is there. Number two, for every new booking, I am donating to the Maui Food Bank. And this is to help at Lahaina or anyone who was impacted on the wildfires of Maui. And so those are a couple things that we're doing to support. If you do know any, of anything else, please let me know because I am open ears. I mean, this isn't something that's structured and I have policies in place, but it's really flowing from my heart to Maui. Now, what can you do to help? Well, come, come to Maui. Show the people there that you support them. By supporting them, they can share the, their Aloha spirit with you and give you a tropical island paradise, right? 95% of the island is open. You can go to restaurants. I mean, businesses are open. All the beaches are open. The only place that is closed, and please avoid it, is Lahaina. Let them grieve, let them heal. But the rest of the island, has open arms ready for you. Yeah, we want you to come. Just come on down. You're the next contestant on Visit Maui. <laughs> um, by living your life 
and not holding back and still coming is your support to them because it's allowing them to stay working and providing for their families. Remember, it's a, it's a, a, a circle of life, right? 360. You help them, they help you, and, and then it becomes a beautiful, adventurous life. Uh, if you have any questions, reach out to me. But remember, Maui is open. Open, 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 open. Just for you. So come on down.